Hola! Hello! Como estas? How are you? Muy bien. Very good. Gracias. Thank you. Welcome to Leaf Start After School Media. Hi, I'm Tony. I'm your Spanish instructor. And behind me is Blue Robot. Now, if you saw the last episode that we had here, there was a little bit of a problem. I kind of pretended and made up this whole thing about a robot takeover, and Blue Robot got really mad at me. He thought that you were that you were all going to think he was really mean and bad robot, which he isn't. He's really nice. And um, he got so mad at me, he called me a corn noodle, which I, I, he does, doesn't really know how to say mean things because he's a robot. So um, I apologize for making up the whole robot takeover thing, and he apologized for calling me a corn noodle. And everything's good, so we can get going except for one thing first. He asked that I would do one thing. He asked that I would read uh, an apology letter that he wrote up for me to read, and I'm willing to do that. So here we go. I, Tony, apologize for misleading you into thinking that Blue Robot is in any way involved in a robot takeover. He is not, nor is he mean. He is really, really nice. And Tony is a great big corn new. So, today we're going to learn how to ask someone in Spanish what their name is, and a lot of other things along the way. It's so much more fun to go through life when you know someone's name. So, after this lesson, you'll be able to ask someone in Spanish what their name is, which, if they speak Spanish, will be very cool. And if they don't speak Spanish, well, you'll both have a good laugh. So let's get started. Hey, it's our friends Whaley and Aardvarky, yet again! Whaley, of course, now has Aardvarky's hat, chicken, and fruit salad. And look, there's a tiger hanging out with Aardvarky. Whaley starts out with a bang by asking, what is that? Or, in Espanol, ¿Qué es eso? I guess tigers are new to him since he's from the ocean. ¿Qué? What? Es, is, eso. That. Let's say que es eso. Great. Aardvarky says, a tiger. He's my friend. A tiger is un tigre. Let's say un tigre. Good job. He is my friend is el es mi amigo. El, he, es, is, mi, my, amigo, friend. Let's say el es mi amigo. Nice. Whaley says to the tiger, Hi, tiger. What is your name? Which is, Hola, tigre. ¿Cómo te llamas? Hola, hello. Tigre, tiger. Let's say that. Hola, tigre. Good. The question, what is your name, is, ¿Cómo te llamas? Which is actually closer to saying, what are you called in English? Let's say, ¿Cómo te llamas? Good job. Remember that the two L's make a Y sound rather than an L sound, so not llamas, but llamas. Let's try it again. ¿Cómo te llamas? What is your name? Good. So Whaley asked the tiger what his name is, which for some mysterious reason is important to Whaley. Whales. What's up with them? So the tiger says to Whaley, my name is Steve French, or me llamo Steve French. Me llamo, I am called, Steve French, which is Steve French. Let's say, me llamo Steve French, but go ahead and substitute your name for Steve French. So, me llamo your name. Excellent work. Okay, Whaley now asks Ardvarki, may I have Steve French, please? And because Whaley asks so politely, Ardvarki, strangely, says, si, sí, or yes. May I have Steve French, please, is, ¿Puedo tener Steve French, por favor? Let's say, ¿Puedo tener Steve French, por favor? Great job. Now let's say, si. Sí. 
again. Nice. So, Aardvarky gives Steve French to Whaley. Steve French passes by the hat, climbs up Whaley's tail, passes the chicken, and finds a nice comfortable perch on top of the fruit salad. Whaley says, thank you, goodbye friend, which is gracias. Adios amigo. Let's say gracias, adios amigo. Good. Aardvarky says, you are a strange whale. See you tomorrow. You are a strange whale is eres una ballena extraña. Let's say eres una ballena extraña. Great. And of course, see you tomorrow is hasta mañana. Let's say that hasta mañana. But remember, it's not pasta banana, as you're probably thinking, but hasta mañana. Give it a try. Bravo. So we leave our friends for now. One of them has quite a lot of things, including a tiger. What could possibly happen next? And now it's time for our delightful segment. Let's learn some more words besides the ones we've just learned. Let's get started with today's words and phrases. Last week on Espanol. Your TV or television is in Espanol, televisión, or the television is la televisión. Let's say it, la televisión. Hello, 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 hello. In Espanol, the word for cave is cueva. The cave is la cueva. Let's say it together, la cueva. So once again, you've gotten through another lesson. Good job. You probably noticed Spanish speaking people clapping whenever you walk by by now. That's because they can tell that you're mastering their favorite language. So good for you. Please don't forget to watch our other videos. We have new ones all the time. They're a lot of fun. We put them up all the time. So until then, adios, goodbye. Steve French? How did you get in here? Ah, run! Everybody run! Ah!